toute la stratégie de Diota se fonde sur le fait qu'aujourd'hui, notamment dans le contexte de l'industrie... La stratégie de Diota est basée sur le fait qu'il existe une rupture entre les systèmes IT, qui contiennent des données importantes de la data géométrique pour leurs produits, et les employés qui performent leur travail chaque jour, dans le champ, dans la production, dans la maintenance, dans la formation et dans la formation. Et en sales. Ils exécutent finalement les tâches industrielles, qu'il s'agisse de la production, de la maintenance, de la formation, pourquoi pas même de la vente des produits. Sur la base de ce constat, Therefore, at Diota, we decided to apply technology to bridge this gap, to create links. And in this context, we believe that augmented reality is an efficient tool which allows companies to physically and visually deploy their digital information from their servers to their employees in the field. Additionally, the company benefits by deploying an interactive system in the field which captures operational data to further enhance their information systems. This generates a positive feedback loop for the company's operational intelligence. This concept is the basis of Diota's strategy, which focuses on advancing the technology, allowing us to provide solutions which are credible, realistic, and deployable on a large scale in an industrial environment. Dans les systèmes industriels, dans un environnement comme l'industrie, notamment quand on voit des nouvelles technologies disruptives pour améliorer les processus industriels dans une manière de fonctionner industrielle, une start-up comme Diota doit travailler like en partenariat et créer une partnership and create synergy with several types of companies. The first partnership is with the companies who are, finally, Diota customers, the end user. These are the large industrial groups in aerospace, automotive, and petrochemical. With physical parts, there are always discrepancies. They are never completely identical. This is an issue for PSA, which has been looking for a markerless augmented reality solution, such as that from Diota, which has a high level of accuracy. We went through test phases, tests in the lab, and at the beginning of 2016, we tested directly on the paint production line. In order to validate our ability to work in a true industrial environment with the necessary precision. These developments are quite new and allow us to validate the augmented reality technology in operation. The goal is not just to create a marketing story, but to really begin to use augmented reality as a means of working. Some time ago, we started our cooperation based on Diota technology, which provides very accurate and precise augmented reality. Our goal is to allow a client, with the help of augmented reality, to configure his own car using a full-size car located in the showroom. For example, this means changing the color, changing the wheel covers, and adding accessories. As of today, it is an application which functions extremely well. In addition, Diota has developed a link directly to our software tools. In this way, it is possible for augmented reality to be perfectly integrated with our PLM. And this is done simply with useful tools, such that augmented reality can manage a new flow of information, which is easy to access and easy to implement throughout our company, whether that would be in our sales team or in other processes like production. Next, in order to ensure that the solution is deployable for industry, we must develop partnerships with people who are able to complement our technology. What is essential in augmented reality? The content. It is necessary to have information to display in order to use augmented reality. It is not the purpose of Diota to create the content. We are not from the domains of our customers. We don't build airplanes, automobiles, or power plants. A partner such as Segula brings domain expertise as well as the ability to create content. And that content is pertinent and operational for an industrial client such as PSA. This content breathes life into the augmented reality system and allows the system to perform as customers Segula is active in many industrial markets, automotive, marine, aerospace, and in particular automotive. As for the market of after-sales support, we are already very active because we have quite an important business in creating documents such as instruction, service, and maintenance manuals. It seems quite evident that such information moves from paper to augmented reality. There is an important transformation occurring. And in fact, our role in this big project is to bring to the table the content, the step-by-step, -step, we could say, for maintenance and service. With PSA, we work on different subjects, because the reality is augmented. We work on a variety of problems with PSA because augmented reality can be useful at several points along the life cycle of the product, especially in the automotive segment. 
Today, we can talk about using augmented reality to increase productivity by applying the technology to the production process. And just a bit further in the product life cycle, we enhance the presentation of the product to the end customer, our customer's customer, by presenting all of the features and options of the PSA product in a way that positively impacts the customer's experience. We use augmented reality on a full-size car in order to present all of the characteristics of the car, and this solution is already deployed in a PSA showroom. And once again, just a bit further down the product life cycle, and it is here where we work with our partner Segula, we work to bring, via augmented reality, all of the after-sales instructions and processes to the service and support operators in a way that helps the operators to service the product more easily and efficiently.